There's lentils. There's brown lentils, red lentils, yellow lentils, green lentils, lentils. All right. So the way I make them is I make them in chicken broth. Um, I make my own chicken broth. I put chicken legs in the water. I, well, I take off the skin first. Then I put the chicken leg in the water and I cook it and cook it and cook it. And then what you get left in the water is chicken broth. And I'll show you how to get rid of the fat. Uh, a really easy way to get rid of the fat off the chicken broth. Okay, so here's kale. You, the kale is really high in calcium. It's good stuff. So what you do is that when you're cooking the lentils, you um, have enough water in there that you're sort of making soup, right? So you can throw some of the kale in, throw some garlic, some onions, it's all good, right? Here's some spinach, you can throw that in too, it's all good. And here is ground sirloin, so it's really lean ground beef, and I would I would uh, cook some of this up, drain it, if there's any fat that comes out of this. And I throw it in with the lentils. All right, so this is chicken broth. I made it with um, chicken legs. And I peeled the skin off the chicken leg. But as you can see, there's still a lot of fat in the chicken broth. So this is what I do to get rid of the fat. I make the chicken broth, stick it in the fridge, and then the fat floats to the top and it solidifies and then so it's really easy to take it off. Take take the fat off out of the soup. See? Just get take it up, take it out. It's the easiest way to get fat fat out. See? Just make your chicken broth, stick it in the fridge or Stick it out on a cold winter night on the deck, and the fat is really easy to get out. You don't want the fat. Well, at least I don't.